Greetings, Elderly Vegan here, and welcome to my video on telomeres. Most people are probably familiar with telomeres, but if you're not, they are the little end caps which keep your chromosomes from unraveling. A common analogy would be the plastic protective tip at the end of your shoestring. And as you know, if your shoestring is so worn out that the plastic protector falls off, your shoestring will unravel. Well, so too for your chromosomes and their protective little end caps called telomeres. And if your chromosomes start to unravel, you will soon be leaving for the far shore one way or the other from either cancer, Alzheimer's disease, diabetes, heart disease, kidney failure, stroke, accelerated cellular aging, reduced immune function, increased oxidative stress, or sarcopenia, to name a few less than wonderful outcomes. Therefore, if leading a long, healthy life is of any importance, it's in your best interest to engage in those lifestyle modifications which maintain the integrity of your telomeres as long as possible. And here's the problem. Every time your cells divide, a tiny piece of telomere falls off. Thus, they become progressively shorter with each cell division. In fact, the length of one's telomeres is regarded as one of the nine hallmarks of aging. And to underscore the importance of telomeres, there's an extremely rare genetic disease in which the person's telomeres shorten at a rate 10 times faster than normal. Perhaps you've heard of this disorder. It's called progeria. And those tragically affected by this disease typically die of old age when they are just 13 or 14 years old. Yet, there are lifestyle modifications which help maintain the integrity of one's telomeres, leastwise for those who do not have progeria. But before we get into the specifics of what one can do to preserve the integrity of their telomeres, I would like to mention the information I will be presenting comes from six sources. Most all were books written on the topic of longevity, but I also consulted AI Overview several times when the experts from the previously mentioned books were in disagreement, which is a routine occurrence when, you, when you're talking about nutrition and the perfect health-promoting lifestyle. I should also mention one more important detail which has a direct bearing on this issue, and that is the enzyme which actually increases telomere length. The enzyme is called telomerase, and this is where things get a bit ambiguous. It seems as though there are two versions as to why there's an increase in telomere length in some instances. Most commonly, this is attributed to the notion that certain foods and lifestyle modifications are associated with longer telomeres, not because they help regrow them, but rather because they help preserve telomere length, while other sources flat out indicate there are foods, and one vitamin in particular, which indirectly stimulates telomerase production and therein increases telomere length due to the enzymatic activity. Indeed, AI uses the phrase, more research is needed on multiple occasions. But if, when it comes to lifestyle modifications, aerobic exercise was unanimously associated with preserving telomere length. And people who engage in 30 minutes of moderate to strenuous aerobic exercise five times per week will have telomere lengths equivalent to someone 10 years younger. In fact, even regular paced walking is associated with longer telomere length, but walking at a brisk pace is even more effective. Yet it's not surprising that when it comes to nutrition, the foods listed as being associated with longer telomeres were overwhelmingly associated with a whole food, plant-based diet. The food list includes fruits, vegetables, legumes, nuts, seeds, whole grains, omega-3 fatty acids, green tea, coffee, and even seaweed. In fact, anything one can do to limit oxidative stress and inflammation will help preserve telomere length. This implies to me there would also be a whole host of spices and supplements 
which have either antioxidant or anti-inflammatory properties, so it seems reasonable that they too should be potentially beneficial. And vitamins such as D, C, E, A, and the B vitamin folate help to maintain telomere length, as well as minerals such as zinc and magnesium. Hence, it's no surprise that taking a daily multivitamin has also been associated with increased telomere length. In fact, in Dr. Murray and Dr. Pizzorno's Encyclopedia of Natural Medicine, they state that vitamin D supplementation may not only preserve telomere length, but indirectly increase the length by stimulating telomerase activity. And the same is true for a plant called astragalus, which is used in traditional Chinese medicine. And for those overachievers out there, the compound in astragalus, which is supposed to be responsible for indirectly stimulated telomerase activity, is referred to as TA65. But again, one encounters a phraseology. More studies are needed. But since it's a relatively easy thing for me to do, I have now included astragalus into my faith-based supplemental program. However, besides aerobic exercise, a primarily whole food plant-based diet, as well as a few vitamins and minerals, other factors are also associated with maintaining the integrity of one's telomeres. These unanimously include stress reduction and adequate sleep. Also recommended to maintain healthy weight, practice mindfulness and meditation, and this may help with stress reduction. So what foods and lifestyle modifications are associated with shortening your telomeres before their time? Many of these will not be a big surprise. They include smoking, excess stress, alcohol, red meat, especially processed meat, sugar, saturated fat, highly processed food, toxins, and a sedentary lifestyle. So if leading a long, healthy, vibrant life is of any importance whatsoever, then you will be obliged to preserve your telomere length as long as possible. So try to de-stress, get plenty of sleep, and of course, consider adopting a regular program of physical activity and a whole food, plant-based diet if you don't already include it. To your good health, the elderly vegan.